Hawkmoon has returned in Destiny 2, however, it is missing the two exotic perks that it had back in Destiny 1. With Charged with Light mods though, we can recreate these two perks inside of Destiny 2. Now, the old perks were Luck in the Chamber and Holding Aces. Luck in the Chamber gave a random bullet in the magazine bonus damage, and Holding Aces gave an additional two bonus damage bullets. We have several methods of becoming charged with light and using all of them will increase the chances of getting bonus damage. Start off with a shield break charge. Become charged with light by breaking a combatant's shield with a matching energy type. This is a very circumstantial mod to use and can be difficult to pull off inside of Crucible, but this is luck in the chamber that we're trying to reproduce and not guaranteed one in the chamber. Next up is Charge Harvester. While you are not charged with light, any kill or assist has a small cumulative chance to cause you to become charged with light. Now unfortunately, this also has a secondary effect of giving a negative 10 to the class ability stat. Precision Charge is next. Become charged with light by rapidly defeating combatants with precision kills from bows, hand cannons, and scout rifles. This also gives a negative 10 to the strength stat. Now the way that we recreate the Holding Aces perk is with stacks on stacks. Gain an extra charge of light every time you become charged with light at a cost of negative 10 recovery. And finally we have high energy fire which gives a 20% weapon damage buff when you're charged with light. And this is how we recreate the old Hawkmoon perks inside of Destiny 2 through charge with light mods. Become charged with light through many different means and your bullets will do 20% more damage. And if you want to recreate the glitch from Destiny 1 where it would squish all the damage bonus into one bullet, you can. Getting stacks of paracausal charge on Hawkmoon will make the final bullet do more damage depending on how many stacks you have. Then, if you're charged with light, the high energy fire mod will make the final bullet do 20% more damage. As you can see, with 6 stacks of paracausal charge and no charge of light, it only does 35,000 damage to the servitor. But with a charge of light and 6 stacks of paracausal charge, it does 42,000 damage. Thanks for watching and stay safe out there.